what did you see uh, that, that led you to immediately challenge that uh, the positioning was very ample? Right? Yeah, um, I mean, he, he likes to play really close up the middle, so Gunner flagged it right away, and he ground balled at him, take a look at, so um, put the hand up, and he said that he was definitely over the line, so um, you know, great job by Gunner, great job by our staff to flag that, and you know, got Posey another chance. For, for that to eventually lead to getting David an opportunity to get to the plate and, and, and do what he did, uh, just, you know, how does that factor into the yeah, I mean, obviously, you know, Jose ended up punching out, but Hemi did get end up on third base. So, you know, gave our, our best player another opportunity to to drive the ball. So we'll do that every time we can. But yeah, I, don't, I don't see that happening very often um, anymore. But, you know, we're always – Gunner does a great job looking for everything, and, you know, he flagged it right away. What do you have to say about Tristan McKenzie? Oh, my goodness. Um. I think he would tell you he wasn't sharp the first few innings, but he was finding a way, you know, three double play balls, getting him out of trouble. He made pitches when he needed to, and then he locked it in for his last few innings. Um, Tristan getting us, you know, just about to the eighth inning uh, was was an outstanding job by him today. Um, he just continues to get better and better each time out. Impressive to see how he's able to just sort of not allow walks whenever they're an issue to not snowball or carry over in anything. This guy's a... A really good pitcher in our league, and he knows how to get outs. So even if his command is off that night, he's able to to game up and make a big pitch when he needs it. And he's been doing that a lot lately. And um, I just I continue to marvel at T, uh, his work, the way he puts in his preparation, and just an ultimate competitor. Brian came into the game 379 against left-handed hitters or uh, pitchers. So you know when they made the move to go to a, a left-handed uh, guy out of the bullpen. Did that sort of play right into what you were hoping was to? Yeah, I mean, we we put him there to to protect Naylor, right? Um, and you know, Fry Fry's had great at bats versus righties and lefties all year. Um, you know, he's he's done such a great job in a limited role, uh, no complaining, never never wonders why, um, just keeps his head down and works. And when he gets the opportunities, he's coming through. And so many times, it's so refreshing to see that with a player whose playing time is limited and he's earning himself more. And they couldn't be more proud of the way he's been playing. What's the feeling like in the dugout whenever it's a close game and Jose Ramirez is up the field? I, I'm running out of like adjectives to describe him. You guys ask me every day. It seems like what what can you say about Jose? Um, you have to just kind of smile and laugh sometimes because it's like, are you kidding me? You know, he's up there against one of the best closers in the game and has a great at bat and gets a curveball up in the zone and just puts us on his shoulders and you know, he and Josh have been so big for us in these moments. And I, I keep saying I, I can't be shocked at this point, but it's still just so fun to watch. We struggle to, to figure out different ways <laughs> to ask questions. Yeah. You've talked about Fosse, and it just, does it ever get old how comforting it is to hand him the ball to one run lead? No, it's, uh, it's so nice to be able to hand him the ball in the ninth and just kind of sit back and watch. Um, he works so hard in, in, in the, in the winter time, you know, he wasn't satisfied with his season last year. And so coming in seeing him and the way he's, he's worked on controlling the running game, he's worked on the slider, he, he's done everything that we've asked and more. And, uh, it's so fun to watch him out there just smiling when he's pitching, um, having a good time and he's locked, locks it in. That was, we were talking, I was talking with Carl. That was one of the most fun at bats I've watched in a while. He and Correa like that. If you don't love major league baseball, if you don't love that kind of stuff, then, uh, you should be watching because that was that was a lot of fun. That he might be a uh, city connects if you want, right? Yeah, so big fan, big fan. City connects my favorite jersey tonight. All right. Thank you.